Hi everybody, this is Lisa, the original Designing Diva. Uh, I'd like to do a comparison for you of these two faith planners. I ended up with two because I thought the Happy Planner was just a regular planner uh, with a Psalm theme, but it's a faith planner. And so I bought, I bought this one thinking it was a regular planner. And then this is the Michael's Creative Year Faith Planner that I purchased as a faith planner. Um, I was, there are differences in them. Um, and let me just give you an overview of them. Uh, the Happy Planner, I paid $31.15. That was on Amazon. Um, you can get better prices at uh, the Happy Planner website. And at the end, I'll go over what I found today on, on both both sites as far as pricing. The Creative Year Planner, um, I purchased at Michael's and I paid $22 for it. The obvious difference is this is a disc bound versus a coil bound. Uh, this one you can add to if you want. This one I don't believe you can. Uh, the Happy Planner, there's a difference in the size there. The pages are seven by nine. In the um, in the uh, Creative Year Planner, the pages are 6.75 by 8.75, so there's a quarter quarter of an inch difference. Overall, this is 8.25 by 9.5 with the with the discs, and overall with the coils, this is 8.25 by 9.5, so they're exactly the same overall. Um, this is an 18 month undated planner. This is a 12 month dated planner. Uh, so that's all the vital statistics as far as they go. I'll go over pricing at the end. Um, I had done an earlier video that I can't find for some reason. And I tried to do a side by side comparison and it didn't work very well. So I'm not going to even try it in this video. We'll go through this planner first. Uh, this is the creative year undated planner, faith planner. Um, this is the Find the Beauty in All Things, which today I could not find anywhere, um, this particular cover. They do have other covers that are just as lovely. The inside of the planners I'm, are exactly the same. It's just the cover that's different. So again, this is 18 month undated. Uh, the front comes with this little pocket, little zipper pocket to put things in. Um, your title page is also your the beginning of your your calendar. It's an 18 month planner. There, you it's very hard to see. I, I don't think if I zoom in. Um, yeah, it's a little better. I don't know. There are faint lines here to put in your name or whatever you want to make the, your name and the dates or whatever you want to put in there. Uh, this does have a scripture reading chart. It's date, scripture. It's two columns. Date, scripture, date, scripture, date, scripture, date, scripture. So it does have a scripture reading plan. This is a note section. And this gives you stickers. And mainly the stickers are, because it's an undated planner, they give you the stickers to use to date your planner, but there are additional stickers in here um, other than the date. There's like this one is let joy be your compass. I can do all things through Christ. So there are other stickers in here. I, you'll see the other, the uh, happy planner comes with the happy planner. Uh, that's it. There is a um, divider that's a pocket on both sides. And then we get into the planner and it's it's just the planner. It's just the, the 12 month, the 12, yeah, tw it's just the monthly and then your daily. And that's all that is in there. They're undated, of course. There's They're very plain. There's no color. There's no decoration. Um, if you like a plain planner, this is great. If you like to decorate the you know what out of your planner this is great because you can do whatever you want to this planner there's 
bare bones, nothing in it. Um, this is your weekly layout. It's a Monday start. It's, their vert it's vertical. It has your daily verse, your scripture study, five, five places, observations, um, I pray today, goals, and again, it's, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so you can write your goal and check off the day you, either the day you did it or the day you want to do it, however you want to lay this out. And then on this side, it's the same. And then on the bottom, it has a, a place for gratitudes. You want to write gratitudes. And so that's that's the whole planner, basically. It's the month. I'll show you the dividers, too. That's um, the next month divider. And then this, of course, is all the same. And the next month divider. And the next, it says, let joy be your compass. And fishies. And polka dots. It's a pretty basic plain planner. Um, but the, there's nothing wrong with it. For the difference, for the difference you'll see in the price at the end, you might want to go with the plain planner. Uh, that's the next one. And it says, remember to always believe in good things to come. That's like a ombre effect. I don't know if you can tell that on camera. They like pink. There's a lot of pink in here. Uh, let's see. It says, faith moves mountains. Enjoy every moment. More pink. <laughs> uh, this one says believe. Kind of pink. Uh, the Lord is greater than the giants you face. I like that one. I like that saying. I like that. Pink. What a shocker. And this is crosses. And it's green. And I think there's a note page in the very back. Yeah, there's a note page in the very back. So that is the Creative Year Faith Planner. That's the back of it. Includes monthly and weekly calendar pages, divider pages, pocket folder, zip pocket, and stickers for customizing your pages. 256 pages, 289 stickers, one pocket folder, one zip pocket. I don't know what it says on that. Okay, and this is the Happy Planner. It's uh, the Psalm, Psalms, and it says, God, it's hard to read, God is within her, she shall not be moved. That's what it says. And these are, this is a little more colorful, but they're very muted, uh, soft colors. It's got navy, um, navy discs that bind it. Let's see what this says. 12 month planner, vertical layout. 2020 January to December so that's all that says so this has a little welcome little welcome note inside it has a title page that is just title page um, it says he'll redeem my, my soul this happy planner faith edition belongs to and there's a place to write your name and it says plan a happy life 2020 um, and then it has a year to view. It's got 2020-2021, which is nice. I like that feature. I always like having the future the next year. Um, and this 
again, I would assume is for documenting um, your readings, your scripture readings, or to set up your reading plan or whatever, however you want to use it, but it's just the month and then all the days. So you could use it for whatever you want. That's what I would do. I would set up my reading plan in here. And that's on two pages. And then each month has a little um, little dashboard page. And you can put, it says favorite verses, notes. It has dates to remember. Um, it says New Year's, Martin Luther King, Junior Day. And this is prayer list. And you can see it's a little more colorful. It's got some, some uh, foiling on it. It says, let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight. Psalm 1914. Okay, so here's your monthly layout. Um, it's dated, has some decoration on it, has a note section over here. It says he counts the stars and calls them by name. It also has um, your holidays pre-printed in here, which is nice. You don't get that on an undated calendar. Um, January 13th is National Sticker Day. Who knew? <laughs> anyway, um, so that's your monthly layout. And this is your weekly layout. Um, it has some just some lines up here. Blessing this week. Grateful for. So it's got the gratitudes and the blessings is different. Uh, this is your scripture reading plan. This is also a Monday start. Scripture reading plan and keywords, observation and application. And again, every page is the same. Like there's no color changes or anything. It's all it's all the same all the way through. Layout's the same. So this is February. Um, and it has your dates to remember. This is your next divider, which is pretty plain. This is March. Even the stars praise his name. April is polka dots. I don't know. Don't ask. Don't ask me. Uh, May. The upright will drill the upright will dwell in your presence. June. I don't know if you can hear my, those are my daughter's dog barking upstairs. I apologize if you can. Uh, this is, I will give thanks to you for I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. My soul knows that very well. And these are all Psalms. So... I love the Psalms. I think they're my favorite scripture. Yahweh has done great things for us and we are glad. September says faith. And I think my favorite word is grace. I will. If I had a daughter, I'd name her Grace. Your mercy is great. That's pretty it's silver foil. And November is copper. My, I, I have to turn it because the light is, it glares off the foil and I can't read it. My flesh and my heart fails, but God is the strength of my heart, my portion forever. And December. Even the dark is not dark to you. And like I said, they're, every month is the same. Same colors, same layout, nothing different. And at the end, again, it has a note page. And it says live creatively. So those are the two planners. Oh, here, here it is. 12-month dated planner, monthly and weekly calendar pages, dividers, space for creative planning and scheduling. So, phase planner. Okay. Pricing. 
what you can find today. Let me find it. I just looked this up before I did the video. So, um, on Michael's, the mini um, Creative Year Planner, I think they have two. They have um, one Grow Faith and the other is like butterflies. They're $13.99. Uh, the only medium size, this size, sorry, wrong planner. The only medium size I could find was the wreath, which is pretty. Uh, wreath Faith Planner, and that was $20.99. But there's a 20% off coupon, regular and sale price items. So you would get 20% off either one of those prices. The Happy Planner website, I didn't go to Amazon or anywhere else. Um, I think scrapbook.com sells Happy Planners. I think Hobby Lobby sells Happy Planners. Um, Amazon, you could probably find better prices than on the uh, Happy Planner actual website, but that's where I went. So if you want to look around, you may find something better. If the Happy Planner is the one you like. Um, on the Happy Planner website, the prices range for this size from $15.99. Oh, no, I'm sorry. For the mini, the mini Happy Planner is $15.99 to $21.99 because uh, some of them are on sale. The classic, this size, all I could find was the Floral Faith, which was very pretty. It's actually prettier than this one. The Floral Faith Happy Planner was on sale from $21.99. No, I take that back. There were other ones there, but I don't remember what they were. Anyway, the Floral Faith was the one that was on sale for $21.99. The range was $21.99. The most expensive was $27.99. So the most, ex most expensive Creative Year Faith Planner was $20.99 with a 20% off coupon. The most expensive Happy Planner was $27.99 with no coupon. The least expensive, $21.99 on sale. Um, the least expensive was $20.99 on the um, Creative Year Planner. So those are the two planners. Um, I probably will use, well, the smart thing to do would be to use this one this year because it's dated. Um, I will save this one for next year because it's undated. And I, I could use either one of these planners. I can find no fault with either one. It's just personal preference. Um, whichever you, you know, whichever appeals the most to you. I, I honestly don't like one anymore over the other. I really don't. Um, it can be kind of a pain to have to put in all the dates and I'm terrible with these stickers. I can never get them straight and it always looks horrible when I do it, but I'm sure somebody else can do a really fine job, but that is kind of a pain, but hey, it is what it is. This is 18 months. This is 12 months. Um, they're basically the same size. The pages on this is a, are a quarter of an inch shorter than the pages on this one. Overall, they're exactly the same size. Pricing, eh, they're comparable. I mean, if you figure, um, you know, this one's dated. It has gold foiling. It's a little more ornate. Um, you know, it's got the, the dashboards for every month. It may be worth a little more money to you. I don't know. Um, but... I just thought I would do the comparison while I had the two of them and I don't know hopefully it's helpful to someone who was debating between the two planners um, like I said it's personal preference I can use either I can find fault with neither one of them I either one of them I'd be fine purchasing so I can't give you an opinion on which is better and which isn't because I think they're both absolutely fine um, so I hope this was helpful, this little walkthrough. I thank you for watching. Uh, this is Lisa, the original designing diva, and I'm saying, um, bye for now. Bye-bye.